to take a walk around the horn. Today we're being joined by Dragons pitcher Spencer Stock. And Spencer, thanks for joining us, man. Yeah, man absolutely. Thank you. Good. Well, let's take a walk here. Tell us, uh, tell us a little bit about your Dayton adventure. Not your first time here necessarily in your career, but the first time getting to play, right? Yeah, first time playing here. Um, I was here at the end of 19 and uh, just for a week, didn't really get to play, but was excited to come when I learned that they were a high A team. And uh, yeah, anytime you play in front of a big crowd, it's great, especially here in Dayton. The fans are awesome and it's a great atmosphere. You know, this is what you this is what you live for as a baseball player. So it's always good to come home and, and play here. That's awesome. So tell me a little bit about your college uh, college days down in Jacksonville. Played for some some big crowds down there before you got uh, up to the bigs. Yeah, played uh, played for some big crowds when we were on the road. Some of the bigger Power Five schools, they uh, you know Florida, Florida State, they drew really well. And uh, you know it's different when you're playing in someone else's ballpark. Everyone's there for those guys. So coming <laughs> a lot of people cheering against you. Yeah, yeah. So coming to Dayton was a good time when you get on the mound and people are actually clapping for your success. Uh, <laughs> Versus not, every time you throw a ball, right? Yeah, versus not your failures. So, uh, yeah, that was a uh, was a good experience. So, speaking of the mound, right? Most uh, a lot of pitchers, it seems like, will have a specialty, right? I'm a starter, I'm a middle reliever, I'm a closer. You're kind of uh, a hybrid, right? You do a little bit of everything. Yeah, I'd uh, like to call myself the utility guy on the mound. Uh, normally, a utility player is someone, a position player that can play anywhere in the field, kind of like a, a Quincy McAfee type. But uh, I just do whatever they ask me to do, and just. That's the only way that you can consistently get on the field sometimes, and so be it. That's fine. Yeah. How important is it for you as a as a pitcher to make yourself valuable in, in a lot of different situations, right? To, to keep the uniform on. Yeah. I, I mean, I think as a pitcher, and then honestly in life, you know, if you can have all these different tools of the trait, then you know it's going to be hard for people to say no to you. So, you know, if you can close, you can start, or you can just be the middle guy, then you know, there's always a role available because you never know what can happen on any given day. So yeah, it helps. So I've heard I've heard a few rumblings around the uh, clubhouse that you're a, a, a fairly good talker, a sarcastic guy, right? Tell yeah. us, uh, tell me a little bit about your personality. What kind of fun you like to have during the games? Uh, yeah, I like I definitely enjoy hearing my own voice during a game, <laughs> uh, to put it mildly. I think it just brings a lot of energy, and to you know keep it light, keep it loose in the clubhouse. I think is really important, especially over a 120 game season. So um, I don't take myself too seriously. I'll be the first one to roast myself, but. I'm um, probably also the first one to roast somebody else when, when called upon. Equal opportunity, right? Yeah, absolutely. So you, you mentioned, you know, a long season, right? A lot of guys are, are having their first or maybe second taste of that, especially coming off of COVID. What do you guys do to, to keep yourself fresh, you know, when you're away from the ballpark or just to, to keep it light over the course of a five or six month season? Yeah, I think, I think you know, there's a lot of different things you can do, but, um, you know, I think almost like staying away from the game itself, you know, like when a game ends, you leave the stadium like that's it game's over mm -hmm. and you know go on with your other 12 hours or whatever you have to do in the day but you know I think when we hang out as a team off the field I think that helps a lot because it's you're still with your boys but you're not you know competing out here and you're just relaxing so that's important still plenty of, plenty of time to make fun and roast each other on the way plenty of time more time got it Spencer hey thanks for joining us yeah, today we'll let you get it. back to the game tonight we appreciate you being here thank you yeah thanks